If you have been given a purpose, then you are being detrimental to yourself and detrimental to the body of Messiah and to the world. Because if you are not functioning in that purpose, then you are withholding the gift Father has given you, the plan he had created from foundation, from yourself, from the body of Messiah and from the world. You are, you are, you, you, you're, you're stripping yourself from all of this value that you have in the earth unto achieving someone else's goal. You are slotting yourself to be a small cog in someone else's wheel when the Most High wants you to be the light of the world. A repairer of the breach. Someone who restores the waste cities and the desolation of many generations. I would rather do that. I would rather overcome my fear of, of the unknown and trust the Most High. And even if I fall, I'm expecting the legion to catch me lest I dash my foot instead of living a life where I know day by day I should not be here. And when I recognize I should not be here, I'm looking for the exit. Because typically, if I recognize I should not be here, and if I don't walk through the exit, somehow someone's going to throw me out. That's why everything I did before didn't work, because I weren't supposed to be doing it. Whereas what I'm doing now, Father, even, let me tell you something, the amount of times, brothers and sisters, when the account has been empty or the account has not had enough money. We have in discussions about uh, uh, how the bills are going to be paid this month. Lo and behold, Father told me to, to, to give you X, Y and Z. Father, father, father is provoking me to give you this because I, he said, he said you, you haven't got enough this month. For real. From the moment I transitioned into full-time ministry, on paper, that, on paper, that's insanity. You're gonna spend all of your you're gonna spend all your savings on 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 rent because you ain't making enough. As a matter of fact, the moment you go into full time ministry, everyone in your ministry decides to leave. I'm not the one there. I'm not declaring I'm going full time ministry, but it just so happens everyone did, w wants to leave. If I, this is the way I'm looking at it. If Father wants me to teach, he's going to have to provide. And it's the same with you. If he has a purpose for you and you're walking in that purpose for you, though you may be fearful, if you just trust him, he will show you. I've got this. He just needs you to move along. He just needs you to walk with him. He will take care of the lion. He will take care of the bear. He will take care of all of these stuff that you're afraid of. He will take care of the giants. He will take care of the Amalekites. All you have to do is just trust him. And there's far too many people in the body of Messiah who trust him, but don't trust him enough to step out in his word and move into the realm of this is what I was made to do. Otherwise, you will forever be a, 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 you'll forever be a servant of Pharaoh as opposed to being free from Pharaoh but a servant for the Most High. I would much rather be 
a servant in Jehovah's kingdom than a servant in the kingdom of men. Because what you see going on in the world is a manifestation of servitude to men as opposed to servant of the Most High. But if there's anyone who can testify, I'm testifying to you. If he's given you a purpose, if he's given you a plan, if he's given you a function in this earth, it is a crime against yourself as well as to me, as well as to the body, to not move into that function. There are people in light or there are people in darkness who's looking for the light and you should be standing there. 